Hey everyone, I've got another review tonight. So I'm gonna be reviewing a pair of Naked and Famous black stretch salvage jeans. Um, these have been worn for about mm, two years, sort of on and off, but I think they've faded to the point where I wanted to share them with people. Um, I kind of wanted to share them because when I first bought these jeans, well for starters, I was looking for a black pair of jeans or for a black jean. And um, I was kind of hemming and hawing over a couple different pairs. And I had my eye on these jeans, but I, I couldn't really find any YouTube videos on these jeans. I could find pictures on the internet of how they've sort of faded. So I wanted to make this video to share everybody with exactly how they faded. Um, I've had them for um, about two years uh, on and off, and I've been wearing them on and off. So I think that's enough that they faded enough to give people a little bit of an idea of how they fade. Okay, so we'll start at the review, you kind of just looking at the overall sort of look of the jean. Uh, I've worn these for probably oh, between 100 and 150 times. Um, like I said, they're black jeans, so they weren't quite as regular in my, uh, in my wardrobe as, as blue jeans. But nonetheless, they're a really nice one to have to have in. They're probably about an 11, they're quite light, they're probably about an 11 ounce denim. Um, uh, a couple things about them, obviously being black denim, they're completely blacked out inside. So in order to fade them, um, I thought it would take quite a long period of time to actually get these, these fades in them, but I was actually quite surprised that they faded uh, quite a bit faster than I thought they would. These are a slim fit jean, so they actually like a black jean, they fit, they fit quite skinny. Um, I'm not generally in to skinny jeans these black jeans would probably be the only exception of of a jean that i would ever buy a, a, a skinny fit because that's i like to see that in a black jean okay so we'll come in for a bit of a closer look um you see the button so the buttons uh, lightened up just a little bit but when i uh, when they were new the button was just blacked right out the rivets were blacked right out um the one thing i that's really cool about these jeans so is is all the lightning under under all anywhere where there's sort of like a bit of an edge so um you know right here in the pockets right there right there in, in, in the in the in the fly these are our zipper flies right here here's the naked and famous the naked and famous branding right there here's a bit of a closer look all in all in the thigh there Get that in frame. Here's a bit of a look along along the edge right there. See some nice fades all all in here. Like I said, these jeans aren't salvage, so you're not gonna get you're not gonna get that nice fade through on on that salvage that transfers through the material. But that that's okay. Okay, now we'll flip these around to the back side here. Take a closer look at the back. Here's this naked and famous patch that's blacked right out, and it's so blacked out you can almost not even see the uh, kind of the the glam girl uh, print. I really, really was impressed with how how these back pockets fade. I don't generally keep much in my back pocket. I put my phone in there sometimes, but I was really surprised at how quickly that faded right there. So in my last video, uh, I reviewed a pair of indigo stretch salvage jeans and um, I discovered that with stretch denim or at least on those jeans that they didn't honeycomb very much. Um, these are a bit of a tighter fit so so I found that they've actually they've actually honeycombed a bit there and I think if I was to actually wear them for, for quite a bit longer, I think they actually would, would have some really, really nice honeycombs on them. Okay, and just here's just one last look at the jean, the overall look top to bottom. So I would highly recommend getting these jeans if you are looking for a black jean. Um, one of my gripes with stretch salvage jeans is that they don't feel like jeans, is that they kind of feel like pajamas. Um, or not pajamas, they just don't feel like jeans, they kind of feel like, like jogging pants, like really, really stretchy. And 
Um, I like stretch my jeans, but I, I like my jeans to feel like jeans, and these very much do feel like jeans. I think the, the stretch in them is only 2%, so they're, they're quite nice. They feel just like, um, they feel just like, like jeans. They have that sort of, they have that, I don't want to say like they're rigid, but they have that structure to them um, that we all like about jeans, but they, they have uh, just a, a bit of stretch in them like you would want out of a black jean because you want, the, you want a black jean to be pretty snug. Okay, so here's the fit of the jean. They are the super skinny guy. Naked Famous has renamed this into the super guy. Ordinarily, I would never get a super skinny guy in 100% cotton. I've got a medium build, I'm 170 pounds and about 5'10". There's no way that I could fit into them. Uh, but for black straps, these work great. Here's the side. And here's the back side. So my overall conclusion is that these are the best value of black uh, skinny jean that you can get on the market. Um, they run about regular price, $160 to $180. Uh, when you first get them though, uh, they have kind of like a waxy, a waxy appearance. Uh, don't let that put you off when you go to the store because uh, that waxiness will, will is kind of cool when you get it, but it will go away in time and then you'll have this really sort of like nice soft jeans sort of left over. Um, I will do a video in the future uh, once I wear these maybe for another year or something like that and kind of show you how they look even after a year from now. Um, I've got a couple more re other reviews coming up on some some different kinds of jeans so I'm kind of just getting into this so if you're if you're interested in, and you like the content then um, um, give it a like and give it a comment if you've had some experiences yourself. Thank you very much.